if you're watching this video, you likely made an FNF &F cover. But, like, it, it, you're, like, kind of wondering, hmm, this doesn't sound quite right. I wonder what the issue is. Well, uh, I'm going to tell you what the fuck you did wrong. So, let's, I just brought up an example project of mine. This is the stupid Dave and Bambi thing that I made an hour. <laughs> Right, it's good. I like it. Uh, so first, you identify uh, what exactly is it is that you want to replace. In this case, I want to replace Dave, which in this case is just this Poison preset. So just you know, replace it with like Slice X or something. Then I have a bunch of chromatics already here, and uh, I want to like uh, replace it with the Arbiter from Halo Three. Okay, not that one. Not that one. Uh, it was... Uh, it was this one. Okay, so I'm not going to really have the issue with this one. Oh, no, I do. I do. Okay, so if you are an idiot, here's what you probably did. You probably did this, and uh, you identified what the lowest note was, and you dragged it up so it's like right there. So now, so now my, my notes fit. They fit in the scale. Unless it goes all the way up there, I guess. Uh, ah, it's okay. It doesn't need to fit all the way. Just mostly. Alright, let's hear how it sounds. Well, that's weird. It doesn't sound right. What did I do wrong? Well, what you did wrong is that you changed the notes completely. You now made it uh, so that the opponent's vocals are on a different key from the song. Which means it's going to sound entirely too fucky and wonky and you're stupid and you're an idiot. So here's what you got to do. Instead of moving it up so that it just barely fits, you got to move it up by an octave. An octave is the same note but higher. So like, here's one note. Here's the octave, and it's very quiet, but that's okay. So to do that, you just do control A and the piano roll, and then hold down control, and then use the up arrow to move it up an octave. Now, if you need to, like, if like, the notes get too far out of range, uh, you can just move it back down and uh, compromise a little bit. If your notes go slightly out of range, just uh, take the very top note of the scale, press the slide button up here, and then just hold down shift and alt and click the beginning of the note. Uh, control scroll to zoom and make sure that it's at the very beginning and so that this it'll slide up this note to that note. So I'm just going to do that with these. So yeah, that's how you kind of do a cover. You don't move it up slightly until it fits in. You move it up, you, you move it up by the octave, and move up certain parts by or down, uh, up or down an octave to make it so that it fits in while still being in key. It's that easy. Oh, you gotta make sure that your shit's mixed well, uh, too. Like, this is not mixed well at all. <laughs>
Yeah, that's how you do that. Uh, hopefully that helped you to not be a stupid, dumb idiot.